I'm Jürgen Falke, Head of Bike Design at Merida. In front of me, there's our completely revised 120mm Fully 120. Here, we see a direct comparison between the current and the upcoming generation of our 120. As for our successful Fullies 120, we've discovered optimization potential in two areas. First, regarding frame weight, and second, in terms of kinematics. In order to reduce frame weight, we have scrutinized all details. A good example is the rocker link, which our current 120 features as a one-piece carbon component with very large volume. In case of the new 120, the successful diminishment of the rocker link by 30% allowed a huge weight reduction, while the carbon version's weight could be undercut considerably in spite of the utilization of aluminium. Another example is the suspension pivot that has so far been constructed as a solidly forged component. Our new 120 features this pivot as a thin-walled, lightweight and integrated element which is welded into the hydroforming seat tube. Since this year, we've been utilizing the MORE system to optimize the kinematics of the rear stay. MORE stands for Merida Optimized Ride Engineered. This includes the position of all pivot points that are relevant for rear stay operation. The suspension pivot point and the hinge points at the rocker link. The current 120 has very progressive kinematics. The bike is very propulsion orientated and superbly suitable for marathons. However, the total travel of 120 mm is utilized rather seldom during normal use. The new layout of all pivot points represents a significant change in the 120's characteristics. Now the bike is able to utilize the complete suspension travel also during normal use without the danger of bottoming out. Nevertheless, the bike is totally propulsion neutral and does not bob also during aggressive cycling. The organically shaped hydroforming top tube has a one-piece rear end, while its organic design offers a perceptibly enhanced standover height. As a result of this optimization package, our already great 120 turned into one of the world's best all-rounders.